Who are you? You cannot take a boat to the aquatic ruins until the princess returns. Sorry, but you must come back later. Oh, bummer. What are we gonna do? Too bad, twit. Well, we could just wait here until the princess's boat returns from the ruins. No, but that plan works for me. Oh, I guess it only works for me. I have better things to do anyway. So yeah, let's go scout the village so we can properly plan the conquest. I have to create a ghost distribution table for this area. So long. I guess I'll go to the Heroes Association. <sighs> I'm disappointed. Okay. Slave, now's our chance. Hee <laughs> hee. Ha 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 ha. James, come out, show yourself. Oh, but dear, I can, shall we? Eh? Oh, Master, I, James, your humble servant of evil, have been awaiting your. eagerly awaiting your call. Really? Anyway, James, listen, I've been formulating new dastardly designs. I call them Woo the Princess Win the World. Oh, that's my master. I, James, am so moved that I cannot help but cry hot foot tears. Haha, <laughs> you'll be more more moved by this. Now let me explain my strategy. Didn't tell you before, but I defeated a fake called the Sewer Evil King who obtained a new magical ability. Using this new power, I can control and manipulate human souls. Splendid, master. I am so proud and honored and... Haha, <laughs> calm down, James. My plan is to use this power and brainwash the brat princess. Seems that humans will do anything for a little twit. <laughs> All I have to do is control the girl, and I'll control these full humans. Ha ha ha, world conquest is cake. Oh, how exceptionally evil, how meticulously malevolent. You even inspires me so much, master. Ha ha ha. Yes, I am great. Now, my minions, there's only one potential problem. That is, to brainwash the princess, we have to get close to her. Within a breath of her, actually. So, Ari, naturally, your task is to get as close to the princess as possible. Okay. How? I'll do my best. How? It's your task to find it out. I must I do everything myself and James. Yes, Master, I, James, understand my task completely. Oh, James, Ari, follow James's example. Unquestioning loyalty and worship. A fine portrait. Yes, of course, I, James, will provide my most dedicated support from far away as always. No, no, James, not that. You have to carry your own mission to carry out. You have your own mission to carry out. Perfect, darling, I'm coming now. Ha! Bye. Uh, fine, I'll tell him later. Now, slave, there's not much to do until the princess arrives. Run around town and gather info. Oh, so I want to test my brainwashing technique. <laughs> okay. First, can I get into this lighthouse? This lighthouse looks suspicious. I like suspicious places. I'm going inside, don't move. Bye. What's that? Ick, it's a ras rat's nest. It's not what I wanted, what a disappointment. Only found this thingy. Can't humans find more interesting things to lose? Why can't humans lose horrifying weapons like a Rachello Destructo device or seas of lava or... Here, slave, take this thingy. Okay. A acquired letter bottle. Okay. I don't need letters. Those are something for typical weak-minded humans. So pathetic. Like I miss you or want to meet you. Some even say I love you the most in the world. I cannot maintain a peaceful mind without putting it down on paper. Then finally, they deny the letter itself by saying things like I want to meet you, pathetic animals. That's why it will be so easy to rule them. You must appreciate the wisdom of what I'm saying, slave. You don't like letters? Are you illiterate? Maybe your writing is menacing. You're illiterate, aren't you? Um. Yeah. Don't push it, rat boy. How many years do you think I've lived in this world? I've mastered all languages. Still, water runs deep. The true evil king doesn't need to show off his intelligence to lower beings. I told you, a letter is for lower class animals that communicate only through spoken languages. Okay. So, there's a few things that you can do now for side quests. Love them. 
no side quest you can really finish, except for, I think, one you can. You need to run, run back and forth, but you talk to this guy and he will take your rare gear and give you a pen light, which we can do nothing with that for a very, 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 very long time. The other one, uh, as soon as I get there, is this guy. Now, we go in and talk to him, and what we need to do is those items we we're finding all along the plains uh, on the way to Rochello, those items we use to make this man more of Miss Madrill's type. So, what we need to do is we'll talk to him first. I believe we have to talk to him first, then we go back and talk to Miss Madrill and find out what she wants. Then we give him those items, and then they fall in love and stuff happens. So, I can make her give me a smile, I know it, but, okay. Whatever. Oh, why, why, why doesn't, why doesn't my Prince Charming come into my life? I've been waiting and waiting for him. Someone with spiky hair and intense eyes who dresses well and can accept me with open arms. Am I asking for too much? No, I don't think so. Someday my Prince will come, I know he will. So I'll keep waiting. I'll wait for him forever. Okay. So we need somebody with spiky hair, intense eyes, dresses well. So, let's see. We have... We have a punk wig, spiky hair. Uh... Chick suspenders, I guess? And mascara. Maybe that one? Oh no. We'll see. But let's go back to the guy and see. Yeah? Seems something's going on at the plaza in the center. Alright, go check it out. Check it out. Alright, look! On the roof of the plaza. Hey. Okay. Hello. I am the bubble evil king, master of all bubble blowing evilness. I am holding the daredevil princess who snuck into my hideout. Um, anyway, I'm holding her, she's mine. Ha 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 ha. Well, um, um, yes, ha 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 ha. Anyway, I'm keeping the girl, so if you want to save the girl's life, um, well, if you want to save her, you know where to find me. Ah, see you fool. Okay, weirdo. Bye. Blast! You beat us to the prize. Unforgivable, unforgivable! What do you mean, he beat us? I knew it. What do you know, Ori? Fess up. Stan is planning something. Yes, he's planning to- Ori, why are you giving up so easily? I feel sad for you. Ah, shut up! Curses that fake evil king! Are we battered, fried, and on my plate next to some potatoes when I'm through with him? The jackal girl and the scholar geek will, can go cower in a corner. I'm going to go to the aquatic ruins. Well, let me go with you. I, only I can examine the princess with proper detail. I cannot let you guys go alone. I got it. Let's go to the mayor's house and get the details of the story. Okay. Bye. Have fun. Okay, well, it, 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 camera- oh god, oh fuck, oh god. <laughs> the camera is constantly freaking out. Okay, well, anyway, let's go talk to this guy. Uh, so she wants spiky hair. Thank you. Now with my punk hair style, I'll steal her heart. I have a little confidence now, but it's not enough. Someday she'll notice me, I'm sure. Um, and then mascara. Sorry, it's it's not the right thing. I'm really sorry. Oh, it's not the mascara. Tense eyes. Did I miss a thing? I think I missed a thing. Sorry. Okay, what about suspenders? Thank you. Now with my superb taste, I'll make her mine. Now, I need to find... Mysterious gaze, okay. Uh, 
I need to go find one more thing. So when I find it, I will point it out in the video later. Now to go searching. Yay. Hi there, have you heard of messages in a bottle? You put your message in a bottle and release it out of river or sea. What if someone somewhere found the bottle and read the message inside? Don't you think that your world would expand to a new level? And maybe, just maybe, whoever found it might write it back to you. I know, I know, I'm a hopeless romantic. So that's why I'm releasing me messages in a bottle. It is my quest for romance. If I release it here, I think it will reach the lake. Oh, I can't wait. I wonder who will find it. So you have a message in a bottle too? What does it say? Do you want to release it too? What message would you write? Hello, stranger. May the winds of fortune guide you. I have a talking shadow. Is that bad? Yeah. Okay, that's another part of the side quest, which we will not get to finish until much, 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 much later. Okay, so I'm stupid, and I completely forgot how, uh, you got some of the items. Yay. So you're supposed to go to this kid, I'm pretty sure talk to him and you get the last item for the guy from him. So let's see. Hey mister, you're the one who does tricks with your shadow, aren't you? Come on, show me, show me, please. Uh, show him. I'm no circus attraction slave. Don't summon me unless you want abuse. Wow, that's awesome. Great show. Here, take this. Yeah. Okay. So I'm dumb. <laughs> See, anyone who witnesses my grand visage is compelled to bestow gifts and thanks. Ha ha ha. Okay. Now we go back to the guy, give him that, and then we have one last thing that we have to do. I have a little confidence now, but it's not enough. Someday she'll notice me, I'm sure. Oh. Yes, it would help to go in and give him the item, wouldn't it? Here it is. Thank you. Now with my passionate eyes, I'll sweep her away. I have a fair amount of confidence, but I guess it's not enough. I won't give up, though. Okay. Now, we have to go back into that cafe, or whatever. Restaurant. Place. Thing. Right here. I believe we talked to this guy. There's so many people claiming to be heroes showing up, I almost ran out of supplies. For some reason, it seems good seafood is not available lately. In Rochello, of all places, go figure. We may have to start serving salad instead of seafood. No. Hey kiddo, why don't you learn to fish? Fishing is good, it calms your mind. Uh, sounds like fun. Oh, you knew that, huh? Yes, fishing is indeed good. A spiritual sport. Uh, da, 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 da. Hmm. my stout body, I'll steal her gaze. I think I've gained a lot of confidence. I'm almost there. I just need a little more. I'm not very good at talking. Okay. Now we go and talk to the guy behind the bar, I believe. And she. What? Is there anything wrong? Tell me how to talk to sweet girls. Huh? Oh, you were still young and you asked me such a thing? Oh boy. Well, that's all I thought about when I was young too. Ha ha ha. Well, let me see. Usually a straight ball is favored rather than throwing a curve. You were so beautiful that all the words in the world aren't enough to describe your brilliance. So the only thing I can say is, 
I love you. How about that? A little corny, but it's good for this kind of thing. Why don't you write it down? I was just thinking about when I was young. Ha ha ha. I like how one of the options was, How the heck are ya? Just walk up and he's like, Sup, man? How are you doing? How are you doing? Okay. Eh, give me a cool catchy line. Hmm. Oh, thank you. This is what I need. You're so beautiful that all the world words in the world aren't enough to describe your brilliance, so the only thing I can say is I love you. Cool. It's the ultimate line. I'll confess my feelings to her. Okay. Bye. Have fun waddling all the way there with all the ghosts. Okay. So I believe that's all that we can do right now for that side quest. So, in the meantime... Okay. In the meantime, let's go talk to the mayor, which I believe is right here. Yes. I think this time we should use a local hero. How about my nephew, Bob? No, no, we should use my son-in-law, Charlie. But father, I'm just a book-trained hero who got my certificate through a correspondent course. See, Bob has been doing actual hero work for three months. It's decided. What are you talking about? I hear your nephew can't even ride a horse. It's better than some book train hero. Oof. Oh well, I think the mayor may be busy for a while. Nah. Okay. Hello. Oh, you must be Hiro Rosalind. Yes, I am. Oh, this is such an honor. This is a famous hero, the master of lightning rapia. We're so lucky you've come to have such a mighty hero here in our time of need. Stop it, it's embarrassing. <laughs> now I'm the world's number one ghost scholar, Gut and Kissling. Ha ha ha. Oh, good. My name is... Baleen. Baloon? I don't know. I am the Chamberlain of the Princess Marlene. In fact, I have a special favor to ask of you. Could you please listen? The rescue of the princess is a national issue. Not a moment is to be lost, as townspeople tend to be, well, townspeople. I have a personal favor to ask. I see, you needn't say more. I'm a professional hero. I will rescue Her Highness the Crown Princess. Okay, da ba da da. Oh, now there's a real hero. You'll do it for me. Of course, once you rescue the princess, she'll personally honor you. By the way, who's this boy over there? Oh, this boy is, yes, he's my protege. Pro, protege. I forgot how the word was said, I'm sorry. Ha ha ha. Mm. Doesn't seem, it's not like that won't be dangerous. Mm. It will be fun. Um, excuse me, Baleen, is there anything wrong with this boy? Mm, well, he looks pretty bright. Well, now, thank you very much. I will prepare a boat for you. Please hurry to the port. Okay. Okay. Well, I do believe I shall end this episode right here. Yay, the camera did a good thing and it zoomed in and made it look all nice and pretty and all that. But anyway, <laughs> this is Robo Joey signing off. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. So crazy. I show flaily. <laughs> the heck? <laughs>